Hey guys, I'm your girl Jenny Beauty Reviews. Welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well and staying safe. In today's video, I'm going to do a huge collective haul from... We have a lot here. Let me see. <laughs> we have Burlington, Marshalls, The Dollar Tree, and Ulta. Um, I was going to do each video separately from each store. But then I was just like, let me just sit down. I just came from work. I barely took off my uniform and I just put on just something comfortable and like literally that's what it is. Um, <laughs> so I just want to like sit down and make this one video. I'm not sure if it's going to be a long one. I'm going to try to speed through some things um, and not to not I don't want to spend too much um, time on a single product. But if you are um, interested in seeing what I have um like i said it's gonna be a collective haul from today i went out shopping after work and um today is tuesday and so i figured i'd go to the stores to see what i can find because i know on tuesdays that's where a lot of the merchandise comes out and i get to play and do some shopping so anyways let's get right on in if you like these kinds of videos give this video a huge thumbs up subscribe if you are new here i'd greatly appreciate it hit that bell post notification that way you're notified when i upload a new 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 video and leave me some sweet comments down below i greatly appreciate it just before we get into it i'm doing a shop miss a mystery box giveaway there's going to be two winners on my instagram so i would just ask if you guys go ahead and check that out if you're interested it's open for the united states and international so there you have it i will leave down below in my description box the link to my instagram that way you guys can go ahead check that out and follow me so without further ado let's just jump right on in um the least amount of stuff i found was from marshall's so i think we're gonna start with that first so here's a marshall's bag literally i only found a couple items the first item i found was this palette right here from laura geller this is the the casual collection multi finish eyeshadow palette this i got for a future giveaway or to give to one of my friends in friend mail i personally don't support laura geller um but you know i saw this for very affordable this palette was $2.99 and i opened it i checked it out it looks really nice on the inside and i figured somebody out there will enjoy this for um like giveaway or like a friend mail so this is how it looks on the inside so that's how it looks it's brand new what a nice mirror i mean the shades are very neutral and that you are interested in let me know i will absolutely put that in a future giveaway or if one of my friends you guys know who you are if you guys any of you want this just let me know be like jennifer i want it i will send it to you literally i don't mind um so like i said that was so affordable um the next thing i found was this bh cosmetics midnight festival brush set this brush set offers 10 piece brush collection with a brush holder and this baby was $9.99 so here's the packaging it looks really cute um and then it's from beach cosmetics so let me go ahead and show you this on the inside so when i saw this color and the brushes it made me so happy so this is how it looks i am so excited and yeah there's completely 10 brushes in here and they're all full size and i'm so excited for this and then all the way at the bottom is a brush holder so it does have this baby right in there and that's so awesome i mean for ten dollars right um so i got this guy so it would look like this so cute um, let me know if you guys are into BH Cosmetics. If you've seen this in Marshalls, let me know. And do you think $9.99 is worth the price point? I think so. I'm excited. So, yay for that. And then I found some other brushes <laughs> from uh, BH Cosmetics. So, there's three brushes here. And they were each going for $1.99. $1.99. This one here is the tapered blending brush. And I just love how it says it right there, like tapered blending. Um, and so I can show you guys quickly what that looks like. 
So it looks like that. That's a tape a tapered blending. I honestly would not use this for eyeshadow because I have hooded eyes and I think it would be too big. I would use this for like highlighter personally or I I could give it away, but I don't know. It's a little bit too big for my eyes because my eyes are hooded. Um, so I found that brush. I thought it was awesome for $1.99. Typically when you buy brushes, like single brushes like that, sometimes they can like rack up when you're getting a couple brushes. Um, so I chose to get these at the $1.99. Um, the next one here is the fluff, Fluffy Crease Brush. This is the packaging for it. It was also $1.99. And this one, yeah, I'll, this one absolutely will fit in my crease for my eyeshadow. So I'm happy with this one. So and then I got a classic blending brush. So I've been seeing a lot of BH Cosmetics everywhere. I literally had to stop myself and like tell myself that's enough stuff, Jennifer. Like you don't need no more. Oh my gosh, is it stuck in there? I was like, no, Jennifer, you don't need anything. Okay, here's the brush. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I know it's in there. <laughs> here's how it looks. And yeah, this one is absolutely perfect for me. And yeah, you guys, that's that. And so let me see if I can put this back in there. I'll probably do it later. So those are the three um, brushes from BH Cosmetics. So again, I got these were each $1.99. Um, and then I got like this brush set for $9.99 it has a holder and a 10 piece brush set and then the Laura um eyeshadow palette this will be for a future giveaway or like I said if one of my friends um like Lee if one of my friends send me a message like I'll send it to you um and that's it for Marshalls this one's from Dollar Tree and now it's a little bit more heavier but there's not that much stuff I just think the items that I got are like more bigger and heavier so let's go ahead and start with that um, the first thing I decided to pick up was this, was this really, really cute, um, pen. It's a little french fry pen, and I thought for my daughter it would be so cute, or for myself, and it has a cute little face on it, and that's so cute from the brand Jot, and that's a cute little pen. Like, why not? Why not get a cute pen? I saw these like birthday stickers. There's like 250 pieces of stickers in here, and I love sending my friend's birthday mail or like if someone's having a birthday i can literally decorate a box or a card and then here's what the stickers look like so they are like glittery and holographic and so here's the next page sorry for the glare i'm just trying to show you guys how they look if you haven't seen um and then that's typically what they look like and there's a bunch of bunch in there so as we are still um so and then speaking of stickers i also got this 10 piece of the crafter square stickers these ones are like puffy stickers and they're hearts and i thought they were so pretty um so this one says shine and then that one says love and they oh and then this one says kiss me kiss me just kidding okay so and then yeah so so cute okay now i went ham on some hairspray because I found SGX I'm telling you guys I went in on this hairspray and then I found this And then I found this other one that I've never saw before. So I'm going to start with this baby first. This one's the Perfect Purity Unscented Hairspray for, for a maximum hold. And this is an 8 fluid ounce. And um, never I've never seen this there before. Texture spray. And this is the 6.5 fluid ounce. So this is from SGX NYC. And yeah, I got a bunch of these. <laughs> I got a bunch, baby. I got a bunch. Um, and then I saw some 
brand new LA Colors display and I got more than this like the first time is because I went because I did some friend mail recently and like I sent someone birthday mail and so I went to the Dollar Tree this was a couple days ago but I had to go back today to see if they had more of these and they did because I just wanted to pick up some for myself and now these are cream gel blushes and I want to try like more cream products um so this is from the la colors and this is new product so this one's in the color mesmerizing it's like a mauve and then this one's in the shade tainted love and that one's more on the pinky so again this are cream gel blush so oh, i got these two shades to try them out and that's that from Dollar Tree. Let's go in to Burlington. I went in. I went in. Let me show you guys. Oh, if you guys are following me on Instagram, you would probably see this on my Instagram stories. I did post about it. So we're going to get into something that I found. Um, there's this brand that I found at Burlington. And I've never heard of the brand before. But I found a bunch of stuff from the brand. And so... Before we get into the brand, I just want to share that I found Ioni Lashes and this is um, the Ioni Dream Lover Lashes. These are reusable up to three to five times and these were $7.99 and you get eight pairs, $7.99 for eight pairs and this is how they look. And on the inside, it does have glue, so the glue is right there. And look at them, they're so beautiful. And I know what people say, it's like, oh, they're the same lashes over and over, it's just different color packaging. And it's like, I don't care, I want them all. I want them, I use every single style. And if it has different glittery um, packaging and different shapes in the packaging, okay, I want it. I want the collection. And yeah, so $7.99. Yeah. Okay, so that's one item. And then let's get into um this is the cram shop brow necessities. So this offers a tweezer, brow razor, dual ended angled brush with spoolie, and then a highlight brush with color brush, brow color brush. Okay, guys. And yeah, you guys from the cram shop, I figured um, if I'm not using the brushes for my brows because I'm super simple when it comes to brows. Um, if you guys don't know, I just like to use a brow pencil, like a micro fine brow pencil, a brow slim pencil, whatever it's called. A nice, I just outline and then I will fill it in with a pencil and then I'll use some brow gel. Um, so I typically don't use pomade. Um, like brow pomade but I do have pomade it's just I that, that's not something that gets me through you know what I mean like I use what I use because I have to either get ready and go um so I just figured I will start using some pomade just because I have some and I don't I don't want it to go bad so I figured this would help me use it more because I'll remember I got some brushes that will help me do that and then it has the razor so that I can shave the brows um and stuff like that and have them nice and like nice and cute you know what I mean so that was that now I got this was interesting I got this Dove body wash mousse this is with argan oil, also perfect for shaving. So you can use this for like shaving cream or like as body wash. Like it says, it literally says right here. Right here, you can use it for shaving, like a shaving cream. Um, so this is um, 10.3 ounces from Dove. And I love Dove. It's a really great brand. And this was $4.99. Please close the door. Please close the door. Please close the door. Please close the door. It says scratch and smell. Ooh. 
I like that. That smells really, really, really good. If that's what it smells like, then I love it. Mmm, that smells good. I was not about to scratch and sniff in store, so I scratched and sniffed in home, okay? And on a video for a, a whole bunch of people to see. Now you know. I'm that weird person, but at least I didn't do it in the store, okay, honey? It's because people be watching me. It's because I know about music. What? I know about mu music. I know about music. I know about makeup. I know about beauty, skincare, hair stuff, stuff like that. I know when a brand, and if it's on sale, I know to, like, get it. Like, scrap it up. Scrap it up? Is that a word? I don't know. I know to get the things that I want. If I see something, I get it. And people tend to be like, la, 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 like, looking around, looking at me, looking to see what I'm doing. And then they see me, like, I'm recording it. And then they get closer to me to see what I'm doing. And it's like... And they're trying to see what I'm doing and then they pull out their phone and it's like they're trying to do what I'm doing and it's like <laughs> okay that's funny and sometimes I just put things back I put it down just so that they can have it um but you guys anyways that's happened to me all my life so someone's always judging but you know what I found and this was plenty enough. This was plenty enough for everyone. As long as they were in the shade medium, they had they have their their they had like a full face of stuff. As long as they were in the shade medium, because I took some light stuff. Okay, so the stuff in here from Burlington is the makeup that I found from this brand. And now when I tell you I went in on this brand, and I have no little to no knowledge about this brand, like literally. This is four items, right? Four items. Five. And six. So, six items from this brand. And, oh, and then, thank you. Thank you so much to my friend. On my Instagram stories, I was like, hey guys, if you guys have heard this brand, please let me know about it and... My friend Heather gave me some information about this brand and the person behind the brand. And I was like, oh, thank you for your knowledge. I am so excited and happy. I was just like, thank you. And I appreciate you. Help. I was like, thank you for helping me. I really appreciate your knowledge. And thank you for the help because I literally have no idea. But I ended up buying six products like I just showed you guys. So let's go through. Oh, so thank you, Heather, for helping me. And everybody go check out Heather. I will leave her Instagram and YouTube channel right here in my description box. I will leave the two links so you guys can go check her out. She's a really, really amazing, sweet friend. And she's a newer friend to me. So yeah, go check her out and show her some love and support. And thank you again, Heather, for for those pointers I really appreciate it um so yeah I first thing I picked up was okay the brand is Carmindi Beauty the first thing I found was the best brow forward brow pencil this one's in the shade dark brown this was the only one there and I was like yes I need a brow pencil so here's the packaging it's like a baby blue packaging and it's like an ombre. It's like baby blue and then white. So it's like an ombre kind of. And it's in the shade dark brown. And I did not open this in store. But I was just like, like I said, people were staring at me. And so, ooh, this looks pretty. This is how it looks. And then, so like I got a little bit like, like insecure. It just makes me a little bit insecure. Um... And then I hear them talking about me and they're like, I'm Hispanic, but a lot of people when they see me, they just think like I'm a white girl probably. And like, I just hear them talk about me and it's like, I know what they're saying, but I'm not going to respond. I'm just like looking at them as they look at me and they're like laughing and saying stuff about me and stuff. And then I will turn around and be like, I would be like, mira que barato. And then they would just look at me and then be like, oh, hablas español. And I'm like, see. Sí. And they're like, oh, pareces americana. And I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, gracias. Es bueno ser americana. And then they're like, oh, so de donde eres? And I'm like, pues soy de Colombia. Y ustedes? And then they just stop talking. And then like, I'm like, okay, mucho gusto. And then I just keep going. Like, I just go on with my business because 
it's not fair and it's like i don't really care about that like it's just really uncomfortable i always have to like explain myself or like why do i look white or how do i speak spanish and where am i from and da 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 and what parent is the one that is hispanic parent and what which one is why and I'm like okay like too much anyways all I have to say <laughs> I found a brow pencil and I'm so excited for the brow pencil did I tell you guys how much that was that was $2.99 $2.99 for the brow pencil and I'm excited I'm gonna be trying that out um next item I have here is this the Carmendi bronzer brush it's angled to hug the curves of your face, creating an even sun-kissed glow with no harsh lines. Super soft bristles dust just the right amount of bronzer onto the skin, providing a natural looking warmth to cheeks, temples, and jawline. So that's what I just read. There's like right there. That's what I read and this brush looks really nice. I did not pick up a bronzer. I did see a bunch of bronzers. They were in the same shade. When I opened it, it was like a really dark shade and it was really, really beautiful. Don't get me wrong. The packaging was beautiful and the tone of the bronzers were pretty. So pretty. So, so, so pretty. Beautiful. Um, It's just, it wasn't going to match me, you know, but I found this so I could. So I can try the brush and then I found two foundations, one in the shade medium and one in the shade light. So they were each going for $4.99. So $4.99. And this one is the Carmindy Beauty Carm Zing Foundation. It's a one fluid Carmendizing. Carmen Dizing. Sorry. I don't know how to pronounce that. Maybe it's her name, Carmandy, and then Amazing, right? So, yeah, I have two different shades here. Um, so, this one's in the shade light. This one's in the shade medium. I was able to swatch this one in store because when I went to check out, I asked the girl if I could um, swatch it. And she said I could swatch it, so I swatched this one. Only because this one has the alarm tape on it, I couldn't open it. So this one didn't have it, but it was completely brand new. It's just, like I said, that one had the tape. This one didn't have the tape, but this is brand new. When I opened it, when I was in line, she let me swatch it. And it swatched really nice on the hand. This is how it looks. It's a really, really cute packaging. And then right there, it does say medium. So yeah, you guys, I am really excited to be trying this out. I think I'm going to do like a full face of random products or full face of burlington makeup would be really exciting or like random makeup will be like from anywhere like if i went to tj maxx or burlington or the dollar tree or whatever i found something like a random full face or a burlington full face whatever you guys would like to see let me know in a sweet comment so this is in the shade medium now i will open the shade light just because i want to see the tone So give me one second. So here's the second foundation. This one's in the shade light. And I thought I would swatch it for you. Um, but I don't know if I should swatch them in this video or when I try them out. Um, so again, this is the tape that I had like the alarm tape on it. So I just opened it and here's how it looks. Um, I did not swatch it. I did swatch the medium one. Um, I think I'm going to use the medium one first to see if it matches me. Because if this one... Because if the medium one fits me, like, I'll just keep the medium one. And then I can send this to a friend of mine or put it for a future giveaway. Um, or I can use it for, like, concealer or something like that. So I'm just not fully sure of what I'm going to do with this one just of yet. But I do want to take off this sticker thing because it's very annoying. So, yeah. Or I can use the light shade as concealer and then the... I can use the light shade as concealer and then the medium shade as foundation or mix the two. So we'll see what I come up with. So yeah, that's the two foundations. And then I found the Carmel Carmendi Beauty. This one's the Carmendi Zing Lip Gloss Topper. So this topper was $2.99. And this is like a lip topper, lip gloss topper. 
this was the only one there and I'm glad it's like a white clear with a little bit of shimmeries like shimmery glitter and I do want to see the doe foot I'm very curious oh it's really really nice it's a really nice doe foot this is actually one of my favorites my favorite absolute favorite applicator is just like this one it's like a spongy applicator but the inside would have a little hole in it and this one doesn't so it is one of my favorites it's just my main favorite is the one with the little hole in it the one that helps to hold product and so yeah i think i want to swatch this one to see if it's like tacky so i did swatch it right there it's really glossy it does feel tacky it does it's really really pretty but it does feel tacky yeah it feels tacky but i'm very grateful and for the price of 2.99 it's amazing and then i found this guy right here um so this one is the highlighter this one was 3.99 $3.99 for this highlighter and the packaging is really really cute I love how everything is like baby blue and white and like the ombre um I did find bronzers but like I mentioned earlier they were a little bit too dark for me and I just didn't want to pick it up so here's the packaging of the highlighter super cute and it has a little push button right here where you just push it and then it opens so it does have a mirror and now I'm going to try to cover that to show you how it looks. And that is so pretty. Super, super pretty. So pretty. I do want to swatch this. Oh, my goodness. Honey. Oh, that's pretty. That is so, 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 so pretty. So, yeah, you guys. That's the makeup. I do have to show you a few other items that I got from Burlington. I'm telling you guys, I bought a bunch of good stuff. In my description box down below, I will list everything that I got with prices. So, you guys can just look down there. And if you feel like you want to go to Burlington to snag these up, it will be more easier. Because I will show... I will share... The prices will be down there. That way you can look it up in your local Burlington. So the next bag is right over here. And in here I got some shoes and some clothes. I found, like, right when I walked in, this is the first thing that I found. And it's a bebe shirt. It's a really pretty green bebe shirt. I got this for my daughter. It's And I just thought it was so pretty. I got myself two tank tops because... These were like two for one. You see how they're connected. So this one's a black tank top with little rhinestones. And I love it so much. It's so cute and practical for every day. So that was the black one. And now here's a white one. So like I said, it's a two, two pack tank top set. The brand here is Soho Lady Plus Size. So this is a 2X to 3X. And the price for the, the price for here was $8.99. So $8.99 for two shirts. I think that's really good. And to, and I would like to share, I bought the same ones for my daughter in her size. And then I found these ones today. So it's like me and her kid matchy matchy. And I just love that. My daughter and I, we love matching when we can. Going into shoes, I found these sneakers and they are so pretty these are from guess and they have like rhinestones and they're mauvey and they just feel so good it feels like quilted right here and they're from guess los angeles and there's like rhinestones all over it so cute and the price for these were 27.99 27.99 and I am in love with these sneakers. Like, they are so cute. Yay! Yay! So, yeah, $27.99 is super amazing for those sneakers. I'm so excited. 
Then I found myself a mauve top. This one was going for $7.99. And the brand is called Linda Leal. Linda Leal, I think. And then this was $7.99. So this is a 2 to 3X. And it's like a really soft material. And it looks like this. So pretty. It has like little white squares. So pretty. Um, and then last but not least, the Ulta haul is right up next. Um, the last time I did an Ulta haul was just a few days ago. And in that video, I explained to you guys how I was looking for a brow pencil and I couldn't find it. And then I was looking for the Essence Foundation. And then I couldn't find that one in my shade. Um, so I ended up going... I ended up picking a bunch of other stuff. I spent way more than I was supposed to. And I spent more than I was supposed to again. But this time I found what I was looking for. Um, and I'm happy about it. So, let's get right on in. Here's the baggy. Baggy, baggy, baggy. Let's start with the brow pencil and the foundation that I was actually looking for. Let's go with that first because, honey, I am so, so excited. Now, the brow pencil I was actually looking for was the one from NYX. But instead of getting that one from M NYX, I got the... the Instead of the brow pencil from NYX, I decided to pick up one from Essence. Um, just because I want to try more products from Essence, I feel like I have a good grasp on their brand and what, what their brand stands for and stuff like that. They have cruelty-free vegan products. Um, I just feel like I've never tried anything but maybe their gloss or maybe some lip products from Essence and so I feel like I'm a little bit behind on trying out the brand Essence. So I figured I would pick up this brow pencil from F this brow pencil from Essence. I'm excited. And yes, I got this Essence Micro Precise Eyebrow Pencil. It's a shade dark brown. And I am so excited for this brown pencil. I know I got one from Burlington, but I actually went to Ulta first. So, I found this brow pencil from Essence. I'm excited. And the next item I went in looking for was this Essence foundation. And I finally got it. This is called the Pretty Natural Hydration. The Pretty Natural Hydrating Foundation with Holleron and aloe vera 24 hour long lasting hydration i got the shade 030 natural ivory and the this contains 30 milliliters and now when it came to the shin rage i was a little like what should i get should i get two of them should i just get one and i decided to get this one i decided to get this one i almost went for the one that said neutral i think it was like a 050 but then i figured the 050 would have been a little bit too dark for me so i just went with this one again in the shade neutral ivory so let's just go ahead and open it for the very first time because i didn't even like there was no testers for the foundation and i didn't really want to open it so here's the packaging and i'm really really excited have you guys tried this brand before have you tried their products I am so excited. Now it does have a little safety seal here. It's a squeezy tube packaging. Now I believe this was very affordable. I don't remember on the top of my head how much this was or the brow pencil. I will leave, like I said in my description box, all the products from each store and the prices and shades. Um, so I'll have this down there just listed. I don't know how to link stores or products yet like i wish i knew i wish somebody would like help me learn but i just feel so silly asking for help that i just list everything down below so um if you guys want to help me please i really appreciate it um i just feel silly like yeah so i found the um foundation from essence the brow pencil from essence i heard so many wonderful things about this mascara so i found the dual pack mascara from essence 
so this was $8.99 and I remember because it has it right there there's a blue one and a green one so we will get more into that when I come to it honey for a mascara Monday I have so many mascaras lined up for mascara Mondays that I I have a schedule for this one mascaras honey I got some thoughts and opinions about those but so I believe this one right here is waterproof and then this one is probably like regular so yeah you guys if you've tried this let me know if you enjoy it so I got that and I picked up this revolution palette this palette right here is so cute I really want to do winged liner and graphic liner with different colors this is the water activated palette with detail brush so it does have a brush in here let's open it up I've really really wanted to try this out and see how it looks so yeah you guys i'm opening this up right now okay so it does have the brush right there as you can see and those are the colors so there's green pink blue and white and i just can't wait to try this out and here's that brush again i'm really really excited they had a bunch of revolution products there Next up I got was a detail brush and this is to help me do like detail liner and also for graphic liner and it looks like this. This one is from I believe Morphe. This is the M2 M250 detail liner brush from Morphe brushes so I picked up this one just in case because I figured this one would be kind of small and so I got that next item I have here from revolution I got this setting spray this is the candy haze setting spray and I figured I'd try this out it looks awesome so amazing the display was so beautiful I decided to get that and then last but not least I got this fragrance from Ariana Grande and it came with a free water bottle so that's awesome this here is the God is a Woman Ariana Grande perfume. This is a 1.7 fluid ounce and it came with a free water bottle. And I'm going to do this in a separate review video. So that's, so that's it for my collective haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new here. I greatly appreciate it. Leave me some sweet comments down below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. Love you.